Well, this is it. The final video for the Mazda MX-5. So if you've been following us on my social media, Instagram and Facebook, you'll have seen the work and effort that's gone into this car. So just as, as a reminder, when the car came in for its full assessment, everything is discussed with a customer um, to let them know about all the problems and issues and good points, bad points about the car. This is why an, an assessment is vital when pricing, uh, detail and work and paint correction. So for this in particular car, it's really, really thin paint. And if you know about your paint, it's measured in microns. Some parts of this car was down to 46 microns, up to around about 88, 89 microns. Topped with that seriously thin paint, the paint, the clear coat, is really soft. So at parts, I'm polishing and I'm scratching the paintwork with a cloth. Now let's be realistic here. The car is coming up nine years old um, and unfortunately it's had a harsh life. So there is a lot of problems with it, a lot of stone chips, deeper scratches, that won't come out unless the car goes into paint. But with it being a recent purchase for the customer, he was looking to bring the car back to life. So what we did is first of all, the car went through a wash process to get rid of all the excess dirt. It was then decontaminated, so getting rid of all the iron fallout, the tar, um, acid rain etching was on the car. So in terms of contamination, there was quite a lot to deal with. Once brought in, it was then on to doing some paint work. We had to repaint the wing mirror, and then we moved on to the calipers and hubs. That went on to the wheel refurbishment, and once all that was pretty much complete, it was on to the ramp to start the, uh, the paint protection. Paint protection, paint correction should I say. So if you've been following us, as I say, on social media, you'd have seen the state of the car um, once it was brought in and under the lights. So over two weeks, it's been harsh, it's been long, um, but all in all, it's finished. So please comment, share, let me know what your thoughts are. Um, but otherwise, here we are. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you on the next one.